boy. It's eating time. Getting me one of them. So freaking good. <laughs> mm -hmm. These outdoor restaurants get absolutely screwed by the rain. They're all just pissed off standing there like, man. The synagogue is beautiful. What kind of French Quarter is looking like. Awesome. to Hong Kong people who provide refuge to Jews in Taiwan. Synagogue for you. Oh, so does anyone know anything about Judaism? I do. Yeah, so you must know about the, uh, like the ornaments in the synagogue. For example, like the center of, in, of the synagogue is the Bima. Uh, that is where the, uh, where the rabbi um, read the Torah for the uh, Jew Jewish people. And this uh, Bima faces west, which is um, the location of the, uh, of the holy city, Jerusalem. Uh, and in front of the Bima is the Ark of the Covenant. And you can see that the Ark of the Covenant is a little bit higher than the floor in the Bima. Bima. That is because the Ark of the Covenant is considered as the, most, uh, as the holiest uh, decoration in the whole When the Japanese took control, they forced the Jews to live in a ghetto from like 38 to 40 something. And like three, four, four years ago, so I was Over like 100,000 Chinese lived there and over like 20, 40,000, 20,000 Jews lived there. But the Japanese were supposed to kill all the Jews, and they didn't. Instead, they just made ghettos. So, lucky Jews. So this is the average size living space for a Jewish family living in the ghetto in uh, Shanghai under Japanese control. They would have their kitchen set up like this, and then it was time to go to sleep. A family of four in this space would move the tables and chairs and would sleep on the floor. So they got approximately about four uh, four square meters of space for a whole family of four. Published in Shanghai for 10 years. Yeah, if you could, uh, yeah, I, I 46 to 1941 after the Second World War, there were about 22,000 to 24,000 Jewish people of Shanghai. So actually, the Nazi government allowed those Jewish people to uh, flee from their own country to other countries by using a visa. But however, uh, they only allowed them to take no more than 10 marks. So 10 marks is only like two points here. It could only support a Jewish family for one day. But those Jewish people were very clever. Uh, so they figured out some uh, ways to solve this problem. For example, on their way uh, on a ship from Europe to Shanghai, they could first bought a very expensive ticket. And then when they got on board, they could change it into a 